Hey Deckers, today I'm going to be looking at some awesome Ugreen Steam Deck accessories. Thanks to Ugreen for sponsoring this video and be sure to check out the Ugreen store on Amazon. They're going to have some epic Black Friday sales starting on 17th, so be sure to go and check those out. Links to that and all the products that we're covering today in the description below. So first of all, we're going to have a look at the Ugreen Steam Deck dock. This is pretty much what I use day to day as this has an extra USB slot so that you can plug in a USB-C accessory directly. So it has two five gigabits per second standard USB on the back and one on the side as well with the gigabit LAN. And this does take 100 watts input as well. So this holds the Steam Deck so well and it does also hold very well in a case as well. But I just don't use a case on the Steam Deck anymore. I just don't like the feel of it. I do like the weight of the standard Steam Deck. And we've got good amount of cable there as well. This is also my favorite power bank and has been for quite some time since they initially sent it to me for review quite a few months back with the 145 watt charger. And this is capable of outputting 100 watts on the main port as well as 45 watts divided by the other two and is more than powerful enough for all of your devices. And this is so good that we can use the power bank to charge the deck while we're on the dock. And I'll also load it up with some other devices as well in a second just to show that we don't have that power drop but you can see that the steam deck charges up quite nicely while plugged in and it does take a little while for the charge to settle down on the charging rate you can see i'm around 65 percent as i started this and then when i come back a little bit later you'll see that it takes around about half an hour or 35 minutes for that top up charge third device i want to cover is the 100 watt gan charger this is a chunky little beast but is a fantastic USB power plug with three USB-C as well as a USB-A as well. And again, this divides the load quite well with 100 watts coming out of the top one and it will divide across the other three as you plug more devices in. But without the load, only the top port can do 100 watts. So if I plug in a, another device here, so you can see a Pixel 4a fast charging off of the second USB-C port on the 145 watt power bank. And this is rapid charging for the phone. And you can see that we've got no issue with it continuing to charge the Steam Deck with that plugged in as well. And what we're going to do is load up with the GAN charger just to show the pass through of the Ugreen power bank as well. And again, how the power does not drop here. Now you can see that during this time, it's done around 4% on the Steam Deck and it's been charging the phone as well, about 5 or 6%. And we've only used around 3% of the battery of the power bank. Now, because we only charge via that 100 watt port, we do have to swap over the Steam Deck to the secondary port, which can still do up to 45 watts, but not quite the 100 watts out of the other. And you'll see that the second digit starts flashing to indicate the charge there. So we've got the pass through charging charging the power bank which is also then charging the steam deck and if we plug in the phone for the fast charging on the USB-C port of the GAN charger as well you'll see that we still don't drop that charge and because we are on that slightly slower charge point it does settle down again but we're down to 35 minutes for the rest of the 40 percent so there you have it these are three fantastic Ugreen products specifically for the steam deck and these do work for a lot of other devices as well. And if you're interested in seeing the dock usage on other devices, then check out our Games in Hand channel. Don't forget to check out the links in the description below to pick these products up. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.